Hey viewers and welcome back to my mic is way too far away from my mouth. Um, welcome back to my Dishonored Let's Play. So in the last episode I finished the High Overseer Campbell mission and I was headed back to the Hound's Pit Pub. Um, so depending on what goes on here I may end up cutting some stuff out. Um, just in case it's just a little like uh, housekeeping. You know, uh, Martin is on his way to join the Loyalist and Campbell. Campbell's fate has thrown the Overseers into disarray. Uh, decoding the High Overseers Journal may reveal any number of strategic secrets, most notably the location of the rightful heir to the throne, Emily Cauldron. All right. Good job, Samuel. Admiral Havelock and Lord Pendleton are in the courtyard. I expect they'll want to congratulate you. All right, thank you. <clears throat> I didn't even kill nobody. Hey girl, you're happy to know that your uncle is safe. If I didn't save him, you'd be pissed off. Whoa, what the heck? You guys better be training up there. Hey girl. He's alive. Thank you, Corvo. Thank you. You're welcome. My uncle's a good man, and one day he'll prove it. He better. Here. I know you did this for the right reasons. But I want you to take this as a reward. It's an old heirloom one of my aunts gave me. What did I just get? Money? Okay, sure. Alright, let's go up here. They're all corrupt. If this is going to work, we have to take down the Lord Regent and all of his key allies. You know that. Yes. Hopefully the High Overseer is the first step along that path. I don't trust then this guy. We must find a girl, Emily. Poor thing. Who knows what her mind is like being there when you did it? Somehow you took down the High Overseer Campbell against the odds. Thank you. I knew you were our man, Corbin. Somehow, but you knew that doesn't make sense. Measure. And with Martin back, we'll have the finest strategist alive. The Lord Regent must be shitting himself in Dunwall Tower. Good. Yes. And Campbell's journal. Let's not forget our hope. Is that in these encoded pages, the location and condition of Emily Caldwin can be discovered. Well, our entire movement will mean nothing if we can't place the rightful heir on the throne. Frank. We must act fast. No doubt the Lord Regent is holding Emily somewhere, waiting to reveal her, to step out as the hero and further cement his regency. Yeah, that would be not good. Bring the young lady forth soon. There will be infighting among the nobles as to who should succeed the Empress. Nice shot, yes, man. Time is against us. But now you should take a well-earned rest, Corvo. We will decipher the contents of the High Overseer's journal and share them with you later. All right. Sleep sounds good. I could use the rest. Use sleep darts from quick access wheel for non-lethal takedowns. I already knew that, because I do that, like, all the time. Because I'm a nice guy. Oh, learn about weepers. I've always wondered what those things were. Uh-oh. Am I in another place? It doesn't sound like it. Oh, there's money under the freaking table. Well, why does it go dark like that? I never noticed that before. That's interesting. Alright, ready? This is how we do it. In the hood. This is how I do it in the hood, okay? Go out for some morning practice here. Just uh, place this on the ground. No big deal. Nope. Don't hit that bottle. Alright, here's how we do it. Ready? Oh, snap! I missed it. I missed it. All right. Well, I, I could have. I almost hit it. I hit it before on off screen. I threw it up and freaking hit it. It was awesome. Anyways, Admiral Havelock. Let's go talk to him. Are right, you guys been out here all day? Why is my running not making any noise? That's weird. Okay, talk Hello, to me. Corvo. I expect Martin will be joining us shortly. Good, good. I hate to start your day with such a strange matter, but the servants heard something last night. 
moving through the storm drains beneath the building. Oh, good. That's likely a weeper. The poor bastard. What is a weeper? There's no hope for them once the plague gets that far along. Oh, no. Nothing more than a shuffling corpse full of sickness and insects, if you ask me. So it's a freaking zombie. I appreciate you investigating. Just to be sure it's not a nosy guardsman that's getting too close. Here's a key to the hatches. I'd send a servant down there, but they'd die of fear on the spot, I'm afraid. Maybe Piero can concoct some sort of sleep poison for your crossbow if you want to go that route. Um, he's already given me some stuff, thanks, but... Are you sure? Okay, yeah, they're waiting. Pressure. Oh, God. Weeper area. Ugh. Oh, wow, that would lock me down here. Frag. <laughs> How am I getting back out? Oh, God. What's a weeper? Is it a freaking zombie? That's what it sounds like. It also sounds like something's gonna jump out at me. Someone there? No. I don't know what the freak this thing is. I'm just supposed to uh, investigate the disturbance in the sewers. Perfect. I don't know, it could be a freaking zombie, guys. They look like zombies. I don't know if I want to go near them. There was a door over here. I just want to check that out real fast. Ew, don't go in the water. Whoa, what the heck? Okay, just a fish. So that was like a person or something. Okay, so that's just another way out, I guess. Um. Yeah, I guess these are probably just zombie things, and I'm gonna have to... Ew! Ah! Are you... Hello? Ah! Oh. Ah, oh, you're not done! You are literally puking your guts out. That is gross. Hello? Hey. Hey. Oh my god, they're freaking zombies, aren't they? And they just commit suicide. So they're suicidal zombies. That's interesting. I did not know that. But okay, whatever. Switch fancy, I guess. An ancient note. I'm sorry, but I won't be here for the next meeting, or ever again for that matter. What happened here was unnatural, makes me sick to recall. I left the result for our laborers here, blah, blah, but the rats will consume it before you return. Goodbye. There's another one somewhere here. Thank you. I'd be a little bit nervous swimming around in the sewers down here. Um, just saying. So they're freaking suicidal zombies. That's kind of dumb. It's kind of pointless. They're dead, dead people. Oh, what's this? Hmm. Looks like there's money or something in there. I'll have to come explore this place later, I guess. Oh, wait, no, he. What? 
Are they just leaving it up to me to get out of the sewers, or what? There's totally no way out there. Ah, dang it! Alright, whatever, that's fine. That's cool. Can I open this at all? Is there any way? Yes, there is a way. Perfect. Ah, gross. Girl, I don't usually smell this bad. Oh my god, you know what? Just freaking get me up there. You went down there in the sewers? I thought I heard a weeper in there earlier. You probably did. You're probably the bravest man I've ever met. Overseer Martin has arrived. He's with Admiral Havelock now. They want to talk to you. I was going to say, I discovered new power. I can fly. But I was just uh, on the little ledge there. It would be awkward. I don't even know what the freak weepers are. But... That's probably why they sent me down there, because I have no idea. So it's like, pff, yeah, he's no, he has no reason to be afraid. Hey, I dealt with the weepers. They commit. Corvo. I looked at them. They looked at me and commit suicide. Martin, an overseer before, and perhaps again someday soon. Hello. I owe you thanks for my rest. <laughs> yeah, you do. Indeed, you've given us a glimmer of hope, Corvo, because we've gotten what we wanted from Campbell's journey. You've done it. We know where Emily Caldwin is being held. Oh, that's a relief. The Golden Cat, of all places. Of course. A bathhouse for aristocrats. Little better than a cursed brothel. But there's an unfortunate twist. It appears that Pendleton's own kinsmen stand in our way. The twins, Morgan and Custis. Not only are they controlling Emily... Well, I'll just have to deal with them. ...they have the controlling parliamentary votes we so desperately need. So I'll kill them or yes, do something else with them? Have to die. But most importantly, Emily must be brought here safely so we can protect her until the Lord Regent and his entourage have been dealt with. All right. Pendleton's waiting for you on the dock. He's asked to brief you personally. Best. I never actually learned about Weepers, just so we know. I still don't know what they are. I think they're zombies. I'm going to assume they're zombies. Oh, God. Okay, so I guess I just have to assume that they're zombies. Um... Boatman, eliminate the Pendleton twins. Alright, I guess I'm just going to assume that they're zombies then, because there's really nothing else for me. Um, see in the dark, blah blah, see in the dark living beings through walls, including their fields of rep repentance. They're also visible. Um, see useful objects and security systems through walls as well. Okay, so it adds <coughs> the ability to see that stuff. Uh, rapid forward movement for a longer distance. Um, blink even when you're out of potions. Blink can also be upward. Okay. Possession, bend time, a devouring swarm, or a wind blast. Uh, hmm. I feel like bend time would be good to have. Oh, it's very high mana consumption. Very low, very low, very high, very high, high, high. Dang it! So, um, blink I can use over and over again, but these ones I guess I can't because it recharges. So recharging, so the recharging portion of the mana bar will allow you blink. Okay. Bloodthirsty, agility, shadow kill. Unaware enemies who don't see you turn to ash as they die. What? All enemies turn to ash as they die. Shadow kill calls the body of slain enemies to turn to ash as they were unaware. Time of death. This is useful stealth since you cannot, or since you can time your actions so that one enemy, one killed enemy, fades away before another turns to see him. You have to hide bodies. That's good. Except that. I would have to kill them, which I don't want to do. So jump height is increased and falling damage is reduced. Overall movement speed is increased. Build up of adrenaline, trigger, brutal melee fatalities. Okay, I'll go with uh, Blink 2. Nice. That's good enough for now.
Let's go. Samuel, the boatman. Do you need to talk to me about something? Corvo. A moment, if I may. Yeah, sure. Corvo, I've asked to speak to you myself. I know you just did a couple seconds ago. You see, ago. I'm sending you to kill my older brothers, Morgan and Custis. Oh, that's why they look the They're same. It's true, as you may have heard. Cruel, beyond words. Oh snap. Further, my brothers are close allies to the Lord Regent, and as long as they are in Parliament. We cannot gather the votes we'll need to stop the Lord Regent from further consolidating his power. These days, they're best known for exploiting their favor with him to cheat others out of their wealth. Let's just say that not every family evicted and quarantined for having the plague actually has the plague. So that's what that I vision my was brothers that. in every way I could. I really did. But they never did listen to me. They'll be at the Golden Cat tonight at their usual revels. They'll be protected by the City Watch. So it'll be dangerous. Oh, it's always dangerous. Now go. Please do it before I change my mind. Oh, you're not gonna ha like it if uh, you change your mind after I do it. Oh, that would not be good. Dude, can you upgrade anything for me? Piero. Piero. Hey, Piero. Piero, no. Medic. Corvo, my friend. Do you need ammunition or weaponry? Would you like me to craft something for you? Possibly. Let me switch half. Unlocks this upgrade. Mask Optics 2. Perfect. Sleep bolts. Um, oh yeah, I definitely need some of these. Crossbow accuracy. Uh, bolts travel faster and further. Faster reload enables auto reload. Sleep dart sedative effect, it, effect is immediate even in combat. Okay. Um, makes a sword more effective when locking blades and pushing against an enemy. Spring raise radius corporal pistol upgrade. Uh, mask optics one. Allows you to magnify your zoom. Increases storage capacity. Ah, uh, bolt capacity. Yes. I need that. Um, enables have four active. Spring Raider. Okay. Um, let's say. Combat sleep dart. Immediately. Um, I think that's okay for now. Crossbow range. All right, let's use max mask optics. No. Yes. Yeah, sure, what the heck. All right. Done. Let's do it. Thank you, Piero. All right, let's go. Samuel. To the next mission. I'll take you to the Golden Cat when you're ready. I've taken Lord Pendleton enough times, believe me. I could imagine. All right, Samuel, let's go look for Emily. I thought he was going to put the mask on backwards there for a second. Apparently not. Ah, what is that? I'm sitting on something sharp. They're freaking chips. Ah, Why? Why are there chips here? The loyalists believe that Emily is being held at the Golden Cat by the corrupt aristocrat Pendleton brothers. These men are Lord Pendleton's despised older brothers, twins, and they are loyal to the tyr tyrannical Lord Regent. Find Emily at the Golden Cat and eliminate Lords Custis and Morgan Pendleton. I have to go the rest of the way on your own. All right. The entrance is near Holger Square. The main thing is to make sure that little girl, Emily, gets back all safe and sure. Them two Pendletons are there, so I'm guessing there'll be a lot of guards. Slackjaw might have some ideas on helping you get inside the cat if he don't kill you. 
This here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey Factory. They sell the elixir that folks use to fight off the plague. I'll lay low, but keep an eye out for you and the little lady you bring him back. Good luck to you. I know Emily must mean a lot to you. Thank you. Be um, careful going up the street, Corvo. A river hand I know pulled up alongside me last night and said there's one of those watchtowers on Clavering now. I guess you getting rid of Campbell shook up the Lord Regent. It doesn't actually say how I got rid of him, just that I did. But, um... Whoa. Whoa, whoa! Wait, what? The heck? Oh, dear God. I thought that was someone looking for me. Your actions affect the city. A high number of deaths results in more rats and weepers. Different reactions from your allies and darker final outcomes. So am I going to be coming back here every time? I didn't need to do those side missions then. Because, wow, oh well. Good thing I got those freaking... Good thing I got those runes over there, otherwise this would be impossible to do now. Really? Like, already? God damn. Where'd he go? That was, wow, that was fast. That was good and fast. I feel like it's going to be really hard to hide bodies now. Just saying. All right, no one will find him. <laughs> Can't say I like that. All right. So I, uh, I guess I didn't need to do those all those side missions before. I guess I just did it early on, which I mean, that's eh, fine. No big deal. Um, I got them out of the way early, which. That is fine by me. Huh? But, I guess... Huh? Had I known... Had I known that I would have been coming back here, I probably... I don't know. Maybe would have waited, I guess. Dunwall citizen. Thaddeus Kemp, formerly High Overs, is no longer a citizen of Dunwall. He now bears the heritage brand. And by one of the old Slack Jaw. Slack Jaw. Shh. Shh. A minor Shh. criminal anyway. offense to offer this man aid or housing. In this time of spiritual crisis, the Overseers have initiated the Feast of Painted Kettles until a new High Overseer is chosen. Good. Good to hear. Okay, what are you talking about now? Anything in your pocket for a poor working man? Nope. I have a knife. Hey, you're just the man I'm looking for. Slackjaw's wanting to talk to you. What a mess, huh? Whole town's gone to trash. Pretty much. I uh poisoned your thing. Okay, I should probably go. Is that him? Yeah. He's the one. Oh wow, I didn't get everything before. Got a message for you from Slackjaw. He wants to talk at the distillery. This one right here? All right, thanks, I guess. Explosive bottle. 
Oh yeah, that's what you guys used to freaking spit in my face. Huh. All right, I think I'm gonna pause it there, guys. Thanks for watching. Click the annotation in the top right to watch the next episode. If you enjoyed the video, let me know by leaving a like, posting a comment, or both. Be sure to check out my channel and subscribe for more. And also follow me on Twitter for daily channel updates. Don't like some unmuck. Peace off.